find sin 17 pi by 3. To find this, we should follow this method C. In the denominator, we have 3. In the numerator, we have 17. Now you should look, 17 is close to which multiple of 3? What I mean is 17 and here you write multiples of 3. 18 and 21. 17 is close to which multiple? It is close to 18. So we should write 17 to be 18 minus 1. So this will change to sine. In place of 17 we write 18 minus 1. Pi by 3. This is your step 1. Next. Now you should open up the brackets. So that is 18 pi minus 1 pi by 3. Now you should split the denominator in this way. That is 18 pi by 3 minus 1 pi by 3. That is sine of 18 pi by 3 you cancel 3 ones 3 6 we get 6 pi minus this angle as it is you write 1 pi by 3 ok so far next here we have multiple of pi that means sine will remain sine and of this angle you get here. Now the question arises will we get plus here or minus? To answer that we should look at this multiple of pi that is 6 which is even. For every even multiple of pi the angle should lie always lie in either in the first quadrant or in the fourth quadrant. To check in which quadrant does it lie, we should look at this symbol. It is negative. That means the angle lies in the fourth quadrant. And in the fourth quadrant, sine is negative, so put negative. So now negative sine pi, pi by 3 is root 3 by 2. So this is our answer.